There you are. You look shocked. Please, don't kill me. I failed Cronus, and now he's going to devour me, as is stated in the contract. He can be defeated only in the world of nightmares, where he's the main ruler. The portal is there. To summon him, you must find the clown doll in which his soul is sealed. So when you get to the world of nightmares, Cronus will go there as well to get the doll. The only way to defeat Cronus is to pierce his heart. That will make him lose all of his power. But it's not that easy. You won't manage to do it on your own. But I won't return to that world. I'm going to hide in my secret lair, where Cronus won't find me. Good luck! Oh, thank you for the other information. <laughs> now, I know exactly what I need to do and to end the story. The first step is to reach Cronus's lair. Let's go! Is that supposed to be the portal, guys? Right there. Guess I'll need some magic dust to activate the portal. So... Hmm, why are you so angry now? She's a vampire. <laughs> she wants some blood. I think she wants the razor too. She needs blood. You look so pale. Where are your colors? You need some kind of amulet to open the book. So, look at the wax, guys. There's an item in there. Seems like this is a stand for a special book. A special spell book. Oh, here is the save, finally. I need a new handle for that, uh, whatever that is. <laughs> what is it? It's a scraper. Now we don't have a combination yet. I need the stethoscope. If we were to listen to uh, the clicks inside the lock. Oh, hang on. Contract! Eternal life in exchange for eternal service. In case of a breach of contract, the soul of the person who signed the contract will be devoured. Felix. Yeah, the soundtrack is pretty good. I like it too. It sounds different, right? Very different tunes. Or unusual tunes. That we have not heard before in a game, so that's good. Uh, dental forceps. Can we pull the fangs out? <laughs> that would diminish your angry look. I guess not. <laughs> Forceps. Maybe pull the nails out with that, guys. Yeah, the nails. Find all the watchers. Wow, how is that a watch? A candle is a watch? It's ingenious. <laughs> Interesting, I've not seen that before, using a candle to, to tell time. I guess the candle burns in increments. That was interesting. Uh, we have a sundial here too. If only I could return to the past, I would try to change everything. But I don't think I would be able to make it on my own, Felix. Now he's in hiding. He wants me to right all the wrongs. He doesn't want to do it himself. <laughs> uh, 
there's a companion door over here. That one? Oh. Clear the spider webs with with what? Batteries. Digital clock. Needle and thread. I'm running out of time. I'm afraid I won't make it. Cronus will show me what the anger is. What true anger is, Felix. Those are watches? <laughs> I didn't even see what they are. Now, let's see, it's the final one. Clock with a face. So there's an item missing a jam. It's a bad eye. Another bracelet. Uh, what can I prop up the bed with? Think I can find something useful under it. Prop up the bed. Alright, I need to go back to um, the statue. The angry looking statue. The vampire statue. Alright, a safe puzzle. Position, the puzzle of the mechanism is showing the clue, so I can drag a part to move it. So, look at the clue there, guys. The location of the dots. So, hard mode is a different layout. Ping one move on his own. Red is wrong. Blue is also wrong. Alright, so all that's left is a yellow one, but that moves something else with him. Okay, it's not too bad here, guys. Pink and green is done already. Finally, the red. We are done! Oil bottle. Winding key. Wooden kickstand. A perfect... A perfect item. To be using under the bed. But isn't it too tall? <laughs> Maybe not. Hey, the one on my thumbnail, guys. This toy clown is on my thumbnail for this game. It's like the loading screen. Clown. <laughs> it is finally here, guys. Look at this clown. So, the winding key, we have the clown. Do I need to place it back inside the box? The clown is called Jack. Oh, it's a different one. Color pencil, a set of monster animal figurines. Another puzzle here. Go through the every, every magic creature on the map and press go to move the tile. Press the button on the right to change the direction. You cannot cross a magic creature twice. Go through every magic creature on the map. Press go to move the tile. Okay. Change directions. Is there an ending spot for us? I don't think so. Can end it anywhere.
We're doing pretty good. And the final creature. Done. A file, long tweezers, and a scoop. Can we scoop up some of these uh, seeds or whatever they are? These are our color, color palette. This is paint, dry paint. Electric ray, what? <laughs> we are feeding the rates of the use with this. <laughs> These are fish food, guys. Fish pallets. Okay, where are they again? Now, protect my hands with something that doesn't contact electricity. Tongues. Long tweezers. Alright, that's made of metal. <laughs> that's no good, everyone. Oh, uh, we need another item. Unfortunately. What is over here? Oh. Hold on, tongues. Gloves! Rubber gloves. Put the foot in the bowl so that every ray gets an equal amount of it. That is, all the rays must become equally big. <laughs> uh, what the heck? Are they equally big now? Like this. What a strange puzzle, guys. So, combinations of fish food, different colors. <laughs> a folio amulet, that was a not puzzle. But no complaints from me because we finished it already. The folio. This is a spell book. The recipe book. Read the recipe book. So these are the things that we need to find. Magic recipe pollen. Yeah, these are the strange patterns, guys. Uh, that looks like a pine cone. Honeycomb. Smoke them out. These are coffee beans. Grind the coffee beans. Where's the pine cone, guys? I don't see the pine cone anywhere. Oh, right here. The yellow feather. Uh, we got pollen. Something blue. Something yellow is a feather. And then something brown. What is this? Not the rocks. Not the mushroom. It's a fang. I will take it with me, but what should I pour it into? A bottle. Is there a bottle? A bowl. Use a bowl. Magical dust. Sprinkle the dust onto the portal to activate it, guys. We are going to the world of the Chronos. I 
I studied Felix's books, and I guess I've managed to fill the dagger with magic energy. Now we're ready to meet Cronus. Ooh, Kronos. <laughs> I knew that fool Felix would betray me, so I hid my heart elsewhere. No, my lucky doll. The magic dagger is in my bag. Take it. His art must peer in with the magic dagger. Oh, I hate it. All right, a broken key. A purple bag belongs to our companion here. She won't be able to hold Clonus back for long. We must hurry. Look at these floating stones here. Rusty flag lubricated. A flagpole. Is that a heart? Is it Cronus's heart? His glass heart. Pierce it with a magical dagger. Why is his heart inside a box, guys? Why? Why is it not in his body? Does that even make sense? The file. Flag on the pole. And the pencil. What else do you see here? Only the back. Oh, wait, hold on. The stones? Oh. The metal plates. Is that supposed, supposed to be helpful? The metal plates. We're stuck in this world now, we cannot go back to the normal world. And I don't see any other hotspots here. Metal plate and the key. Oh, how is that going to work? Outline of the key. File a new key? Wow. Of the heart on the sleeve, his heart is box. Yeah, isn't that odd? <laughs> his heart is inside a box, an unlocked box, too. The box is unlocked, <laughs> it's open, <laughs> an open box. Here's the hearts. Make sure that is the right spot. No! Whoa, <laughs> she's unconscious again, guys. For the fifth time in the game? <laughs> How dare you! I won't let you defeat me that easily! Oh yeah? You wanna fight? We do a puzzle fight! Fill the field with the green tile so that your score is greater than Cronus's. Select a tile and an adjacent cell to fuel it. To turn the purple tile into a green one, place a green tile besides it. Okay, so Harmo is going to be a grueling paddle, guys. But we need to multiply ourselves. Whoa, he's jumping, guys. Why are you jumping? Why are you jumping? You're not doing too well. Oh yeah? Oh yeah? I 
think we are doing great. Yeah! I'm blocking him in! We won! That was an easy fight. Whoa! The circus is no more, the theme park. The roller coaster is all that's left? <laughs> Wonderful, guys. We'll be able to go on to the roller coaster right now. Well, this bracelet was worth buying. Eventually, it saved us all. Gloomy Tales, horrific show by the mini games. I think this is the longest game of the year, guys. The longest casual adventure game of the year. Yeah, the mini games developed games are usually pretty long, and this one is even longer <laughs> compared to the other developers of this genre. So I hope you all enjoy this. Yeah, it's a good game. I I like it. Storyline is serviceable, guys, and it's extremely long, so it's worth the bucks. <laughs> I think it's a good game for Halloween. Yes. I like the characters here too, so... It's not bad. It's good. It's a good game. Uh, there's a bonus game, which I'm not going to play right now. Uh, tomorrow is going to be an adventure day! So the bonus game I'll probably do on my own. <laughs> during uh, the week. So thank you all for jumping by! Moderate the way you deserve a beautiful sleep right now. <laughs> So go on ahead, have a good night. Sweet dreams. Alright everybody, I'll see you all next time. Thank you all for jumping by.